Hi, I'm Kevin Duffy, head golf professional here at Riverton Country Club, and I wanted to talk to you today about how to properly replace or fill a divot. All right, so here we've got two different styles of divots. Number one, uh, we've got a big, healthy divot. This one is the one we want you to try and replace every time. Try and track it down, and we're going to try and put that back in its home. The second divot we've got is an exploded divot. Uh, this one's kind of exploded into four or five different pieces. It's really shallow. There's not much roots to it. So this one isn't really going to grow back. Um, so with the healthier divot, we're going to find that. We're going to place it back in its location, and we're going to give it one firm step. All right, That's gonna, that has a really good chance of growing back. The smaller divot, we're going to get rid of those pieces, and we're going to take our fill. With the fill, we're going to just slowly fill that up. And we want to fill it almost all the way up and then give it a nice firm step um, just to level it off and we're good to go. Um, if everyone could take their time, find their divot, replace their divot, the golf course will be in great condition all summer long. Thanks a lot and have a great day. Hi, I'm Drew White. I'm the superintendent here at Riverton Country Club. And today I'm gonna wanna show you how to properly fix a ball mark on the green. So what we wanna do is take your divot repair tool and go into the high side and push in. And then on all sides, stick it in and push in towards the center. Do not pry it up. And then take your club or putter and tap down and remember that you want to fill yours and one more. And if everybody does that, we'll have nice, smooth, pure putting services.